First, add a cylinder and set the vertices to whatever fits your needs in the last operation panel in the bottom left window. We'll keep it at 32 for this tutorial. Then, rotate the cylinder 90 degrees, extend your cylinder's length. Add loop cuts by hitting Ctrl and R. Change the amount of loop cuts to a considerate liking by either using the mouse wheel or the last operation panel. Delete the face where we will scale up our flare. Select the edge where our flare will be scaled and get ready to scale along the normals by hitting Alt plus S. Before we scale, we must make sure that proportional editing is on and sharp is chosen. This is an important setting that will allow us to scale our flare to a smooth exponential curve as seen in most acoustic signals or horns or whatnot. You can add some more flare near the rim of the horn by scaling said rim to taste with a smaller proportional range. Solidify the horn to taste, and there you go. The horn, fog signal, trumpet, or whatever you can come up with. You can use this technique with various shapes and sizes and come up with many kinds of designs. For example, here's a 3D model of the fog signal found at the Souter Lighthouse in England.